All righty. Happy Tuesday, May 21st, Psalm 145, 1 to 7 again. I exalt you, my God, the King, and bless your name forever and ever. I will bless you every day. I will praise your name forever and ever. The Lord is great and is highly praised. His greatness is unsearchable. One generation will declare your works to the next and will proclaim your mighty acts. I will speak of your splendor and glorious majesty and your wondrous works. They will proclaim the power of your awe-inspiring acts, and I will declare your greatness. They will give a testimony of your great goodness and will joyfully sing of your righteousness. Hey, celebrating God's faithfulness? God is our king. He's our only king. We've seen in Hebrews that Jesus is king. So how do we reconcile a new king of the universe? Well, we don't have to. God the Son is proclaimed and recognized as King. We have studied what and how Jesus, the Christ, is our King and High Priest. So that when we sing this psalm with David, we understand that we are singing to our God, King Jesus. Yes, we bless His name every day and forever. It's easy to bless the name of God when we stop to recognize all that He has done. We'd not breathe without the sustaining power uh, that God has provided. See, we notice that in Hebrews that we've been studying, Jesus is creator and, and Jesus is sustainer. We see that in Hebrews chapter 1. He's the one who upholds all things. So, so God is faithful and God is faithfulness and we celebrate his faithfulness this week. So stop. Count your blessings like the hymn teaches us to do. Whew. We'll see you tomorrow.